game coming up. A lot of flag rouge. Yeah, I'm playing bad chess, but I'm playing very fast. If I play bad, but I get flags, that's all that matters. Okay, uh... Play this one. <laughs> this is what Magnus had against, uh... The dude, or something similar, at least. Not this exact setup, but similar. And I can always go D5. I'll, I'll just do it here. Force a trade. Okay, I'll do this one. Just trade. Go here, but should be 7, H6, G5. Of course, the right moments. It goes queen e2. I guess I'll just play rook e8. Go g5. Wait, what? This is a free piece. Yeah, he just blundered a free piece. Sorry, this is very. This is just hot water from earlier that I boiled. So that's why it's like I'm like ah. Okay, so I'm up a piece here. It's not like it's winning necessarily, but I am in good shape if I play this precisely. Let's see. Actually, not trivial at all, huh? I take. <laughs> Let's see. I'll go here and force a trade. Not trivial. I assume this was winning. I think it still is, but it's tricky. I'm going to hit the rook. Hit the pawn. My king is very safe with the bishop and the knight right around it, but we'll see if it's enough. I mean, I can bring the queen back. I always have checks and bring the queen back to g6 as well. We'll see what he does. Uh, that's how you react to taking a shot. Uh, that, that's fair. That's fair. Okay. If I just take, I can drop the queen back, I believe. I also have bishop f6, too. And then there's queen c4. So let's just, uh, queen c4, yeah. Okay, so let's go check. Let's drop the queen back. Not up a lot of time in this game, though, so it's not simple to play either. It takes a four, which I don't know if it's actually a bad move, but it just, it feels kind of bad to me somehow. I don't know why, but I'll go, I'll go here. Cause he wants to go knight h4, knight f5. I'll go here, hit the pawn. Takes, I will take, of course. Like what is the count here? I have two pawns for, so he's got two pawns for the bishop, basically. Thanks. So I shouldn't be able to lose, but can I win is the question. We'll see. So uh, queen e6 is a logical move just to cover. I'll play it. Maybe not best. I probably should have. Eh, I should have moved the king. Okay, whatever. Let's go back. Let's reset. Go. I can go knight e6, I guess, but I'll go here. Oh, did I just blunder? Yeah, I missed work up seven. Jeez. Still kind of okay, but. Ugh. If queen c8 is a move. If I go here. Goes there. I have queen. G6. It's check. 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 You lose. Any other shit Anna Perkin for the four months? Yeah, it's just check. There we go again. So let's keep rolling. I'm 11 points back of Jose. We're both on big streaks here. So uh, he did not have her take G7. And now I get another bad pairing. I get Jobava. I am boosting my rating, though. Uh, let's just develop, I guess. Oh, he plays a5. I guess I'll just play a3. 
So a four. Simple chess here, I guess. Uh, I will go just here, I guess. Take the blue pill sixteen. Just subscribe. It is B four. I'm gonna go knight A four here. I don't know if it's the best move, but it's a move. Just trying to go knight G three, knight F five, and just attack, attack, attack. It is D five. Interesting move. I don't want to really take on E five. I don't also want to take on D five. What do I do here? Knight g3 is a move, but it feels wrong. Takes. Knight g6, e5, knight e4 also feels wrong. I guess I'll just take. Takes with a knight, I guess. I guess I'll just go f5. It's probably the bad, it's probably a bad move, but I'm going to go for some like knight g3, knight e4 and just try to play a quick game of chess here. And, and dodge, like, big time pressure that would be coming otherwise. Uh, let's go here on bishop b3. I mean, I have queen g4 too. Who takes? I take. Did I just blunder? Kind of. It's bad, but how bad is it, actually? I mean, I have an outpost on e4. I go like queen e2, knight e4. It's, it's not great. Oh, but now I just hang a pawn instead. Lovely. Stupid. So let's just go here. And this game, I'm actually not even up on clock, so it's very bad. I'm going to need some kind of cheese here to win. Or not lose, I should say. Jose won again. Who is Jose playing against you guys? Is he playing top players too, or is he getting like a little bit easier pairings at the moment? I hit the pawn on a5, but it's bad. Oh, he's getting easier pairings. He's playing chess queen. Okay. Yeah. He's winning these games really fast, so I assume he's getting slightly softer pairings. Of course, what's really annoying about this is that like the first game, like literally cost me an extra like couple of points. At least. Wait. Of course, I didn't even see knight c3. But I take, I go here, knight e4. Yeah, that's what's actually annoying. I have f6. I also have knight e4. Wait. I'm going to go f6. Okay, I'm going to get chances here, I think. Go here. Wait, I feel like there should be tricks. Go here. Trying to be very sneaky and slippery. If I go here, he has rookie eight and bishop f8, and he just barely saves it. I think they'll just take the blue pill for the uh, seven months. Thank you so much. Take the blue pill. He goes there. Of course, I just eat the juicer. I think I'm going to win this game now, though, because everything's a little bit loose here. I have rook c1, rook c6, play h4. But take with a pawn is also a big question. <sighs> Tough. I'll take with a pawn, I guess. Go here. Why did I do that? Go here. Uh, why did I do that too? Let's take. What am I doing? I just have to move quickly. I mean, I should be able to flag him here if I'm not crazy. Go here. Go 
There we go. Checkmate. All right, we got another win. Let's go. All right, next game up to 43. I think there's a Hugh, he who eats wolf thing to steal for the prime. Of course, I get another bad pairing. I get Bordnik here in a must win situation. Uh, I guess I'll play Sicilian. Let's take. Uh, I'm going to play a weird line. I'm going to do a bishop d7, c6 here. Go here. It's not a standard line at all, but it's playable. A3, I'll go bishop d6, of course. We're straight and still right in it. Yeah, but the problem is Jose's getting easy pairings. I'm way behind already. Play h6. I don't even know if it's a good move, but I'll do it. It's a weird move. I'll play rookie eight. So here, I mean, mind you, of course, it, there is there is RNG. So like, if he gets easy pairings and wins every game, there's just I mean, there's nothing I can do about it. That's just reality. There's B four. Of course, I should play A six to stop this. Okay, I'll go here. Give okay, it now. I feel like. Who's actually attacking here is the question. I'll go knight b6, queen d6. Like I'm the I'm the one actually trying to attack here on the uh, on the uh, king side a little bit. B5. Oh, I didn't see b5. Shoot. Ah, that's unfortunate. Knight d5. I guess I'll go here and take. I have knight d5, maybe. Takes. Okay, bishop b5. I will obviously take e3 and go rook f8 because the uh the this there are light square issues here for, for white for sure. That's what I'm playing for. I'm playing for the light square issues. So e5. Of course, I should not have allowed that either, but I'll go here and like queen g5, maybe. Probably I should have just played rook e6 to take the pawn, but I go. Oh, uh, I don't know if I can win this. This is the problem. How do I try to win this? I can obviously draw this with like any number of moves, but a draw is not good enough. This is a problem. Go here. <clears throat> yeah, like I'll be able to draw this game, but I, I can't win. That's the problem. Yeah, he goes there. I go here. I mean, I trade and it's just a draw. I'm gonna have to defend the pawn forever and th and throw and throw 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 it. Yeah, I mean it's not what I want, but I'm I'm trying. Thing is, he's on what he's oh he's also on 43, so he kind of needs to win too. Yeah, I'm gonna offer him a draw here just to save time. Yeah, I mean it's just it. We, we, I mean the problem is he he also can't play here because the thing is if he plays and we draw after two minutes, it also kills his chances. You know, Jasper with the prime, Izar got thinking of the. On full roof for the prime. Yeah, I mean, that's just frustrating because, like, the problem is here for both of us. Neither of us wants... We, we both know it's going to be a draw, but it's going to go go on for, like, forever. And now I get another bad pairing. I get Hanson, too. Yeah, Jose's, like, won every game, basically. He's getting easier pairings, and that's just life. What to do? Am I buying the market dip? I mean, you know, I saw Tesla at 5% or 4 or 5%, whatever it was, pre this morning, and, like... I don't know, like, anytime I really want to do something, I just, I, I don't know, there's a big disconnect, and I'm not sure I believe it. That's what I would say, like, I don't know if I believe it, honestly. I, it's just, I don't know. Like I said, there's, there's a disconnect. I look at real estate, I look at, uh, okay, uh, I guess I'll just castle. I look, I look at things like real estate, I look at, uh, uh, I was gonna say something else, too. You know, I, lo I look at, like, the sponsorships, the ad budgets, all these different things, and 
I don't know. Again, like the market's red hot. Everything else is not really hot. So I'm just a little bit skeptical. That's just my general take on the whole thing. I'm just a little bit skeptical of it. Jocelyn keeps getting untitled opponents. Well, what do you want me to do? Like, there's RNG. That's life. You want me to throw a tantrum and be all mad about it? I mean, come on. Like, uh, there's just nothing I can do about it. I guess I'll play H4 and G3, maybe. Just consolidate everything here. I have knight G5 somewhere. <laughs> yes, yeah. Interesting choice playing queen b5. Uh, this is actually quite interesting. I can trade play an endgame, but I, I don't know. Somehow, like, at this stage of the event, it doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel right. I could have played rookie one to get a different endgame, but I don't know. But yeah, like, like I was saying, you guys, I don't know. Like, I, I mean, if I, if I look at what, like, also additionally, if you look at what, like, the, C, the big CEOs are saying, they're all saying the same thing, too. No, nobody is really optimistic. So the smart money is not optimistic, and I, I don't know. I mean, it just it seems hard to believe that every that like all the indicators are going one way, but then like the market is green, so the market actually knows better than everybody else. I mean, it's possible, obviously, but I'm just a little bit skeptical. I will say that. I'm gonna go B three here, maybe Rook C one. Is there a QU bird for the prime? Yazes for the prime. Thank you so much. But again, who knows? I mean. Anybody's guess is as good as mine. I'm trying to go B4 here. I feel like I actually am getting something a little bit. Until I blunder G5, of course. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, I totally bungled this. But wait, I bishop H3 and rook F1, maybe. Maybe I'm still okay. Maybe. Yeah, knight d8 I expected. Question is, do I have moves here? Like, uh, do I have f5? Bridget, I'm just going to do it. Why not? Just go for the insane madness. Yeah, I go rook f1, of course. I expect that. Uh, I can go here, right? Or wait. No, I should have played bishop h2, actually. It takes... This is still very unclear, though, what's going on here. His queen is super off sides. So even though he has a good position, probably his queen is so far off that it makes it very hard to play this. Okay, but if I, I can take... I feel like there's something that I'm missing here, though. Maybe just like... I'm just going to go rookie one to trade the rooks. Play as like a practical person, not a lunatic. There's also b4, I guess, too, but... Okay, king h7. I think, you know, the king is a piece, right? As we say, the king is a piece. Use the king in the end game. He actually has to take, and I think he's losing after he takes. Keep talking about the market. I don't have much to say about it, other than, like, I'm not really... I'm skeptical. I'm skeptical. All the smart money is saying one thing, and, like, people are... I guess I'll go check. Go here, bishop e5, of course. Yeah, I'm going to win this game. Pretty wild, actually. Uh, I guess I'll just go back just very quietly. He's got no time. There we go. Let's go again. I think there's a bubbly uh, Grogu for the prime. Flag is OP. Flags are very OP. Yeah. Eric's not happy. Well, he's, yeah, I mean, but he's been losing every game. Oh, that game he wasn't losing. To be fair, Eric was not just, that game was messy. But the other two games, Eric was just completely toasted. Now, finally, I get an easy pairing. So now is where I just have to win every game, basically. Win every game and, we, and get all the way. Get all the way home.
Erica's had insane pairings. Yeah, I mean, it's, if you don't get the pairings, Arena Kings can be a nightmare. Yeah, like if you don't get the pairings, Arena Kings can be like a serious nightmare. Thanks so much to Kitar for the 25 Luxury for the bits. Thanks so much to Luxar. Appreciate it. Uh, I don't know what Rook, what that does. Let's play Rook C8. Okay, uh, A4. You know, we, we don't have all day to live, so I'm gonna I'm gonna try to mess this up with C4 a little bit. And play like rookie. Uh wait, I take. I can take take. Okay, bishop B1, I will play rookie eight to hit the pawn. What is a juicer? A, the, the juice is whatever you want it to be. 31k watching. I'm not even looking at my numbers, you guys. I generally don't look, but big shout out to 31,000 you guys for watching on this fine uh fine Tuesday afternoon or Wednesday afternoon. Yeah, Wednesday afternoon. So, yeah. Uh XQCL moment. Yeah. Okay, Queen D1 is a good move. Hard to play this actually. Uh I guess I'll go here, maybe 96, it's an idea at least. Can I add a Bloomberg terminal to my stream? I don't have Bloomberg. I mean, I, of course, I know people who do, and I've, I've periodically looked every so often, but no, I don't, I don't have access. So I would never spend 18K a month. I think it's 18K a month for to have access. Like, you, you better be trading like a million bucks a, a month for that to even make sense, at least, minimum. I, oh, it's, it's I, is it 35k per year? I thought it was 18k a month, or at least some, some, uh, one second, let me think. Is this a pawn? Yeah, it's a pawn. 795. I mean, maybe I'm wrong, but I could have sworn that there was, there was some, one of the options was like 18k a month, but maybe that's just for a whole company to buy, like, buy like a bunch of, per, bunch of terminals. Jose finally loses the game, so this is where I just got to keep rocking it. I could take, I guess. Yeah, let's have fun. Life is too short to not have fun. Go here. It's 94. Uh, let's play h6. This isn't ideal, though. I'm kind of misplaying this just a little bit. But he's got no time, right? So let's go C3. Might be two. I'll go back. Got oh, what, Bishop A2 or something? Uh, I have F5, F4, which is also just very strong. Okay, we'll win this game. It's going to be back to 16 points. Uh, I need to just keep winning. That's the bottom line. Please resign, dude. I mean, I'm having a good event. I'm playing, I'm playing very, very well. That's what needs to be said. But the problem is, even though I'm playing very well, like, now C2 hangs also. Okay, there we go. Oh, he's not going to resign. Okay. There we go. Next game. Or sorry, 17 points. So I need to keep winning. This is where it would be nice to get some 2400s. Got to be honest. Yeah, my rating is doing very... I'm, I'm great. Okay, 2500. This is just what the doctor ordered. For pushing for the uh, hard finish here. Let's go G6. Did I play this dude yesterday on Title Tuesday? I think I did, right? Let's go a6. I don't want to take with the knight, but I kind of have to if I want to win this game because everything else is a little bit too dry. I have knight h7, I guess, or something. Oh, did he just blunder the bishop? Ha, he did. He just trapped his bishop h4. I go f6. Block, and hopefully he'll just resign. I just take yeah just resign dude resign let's go next game 
All right, quick win. Very important to get that quickie in. That's a very good quickie. It's 13. We need to just keep winning games. Let's go. Let's go. Give me another 2,400. Let's go. What are you guys saying? Don't say... Don't say what? Okay, 22,000. I got to win this game quick. Sorry, I'm going to be ignoring chat just a little bit. Okay, I got to win this game fast. I'll take 2,000s all day long, baby. Wow, he knew D5. That's very upsetting. Yeah, I'm going to move very, very fast this game. Uh, let's go here. I seem to know the theory, which is actually kind of disturbing. Although that's not right for sure. This guy's playing really well, actually. Shoot. Go uh, here, I guess. Take looks at the ice skater. We go here. This is crazy. He's actually playing this really, really well. Go here. Jesus, this guy's really 2,000? What the heck is going on? Block, let's trade. Okay, now I think he finally blundered. Jeez, this is, this is insane. Okay, I think finally I'm going to win, but this is just insane. He's played this game like a freaking god. For 2,000, I mean, he's played... Oh, G5 is a slip. He meant to go G6. Yeah, he's played this really well. No, no, I, I'm not saying he's doing anything, but either he's underrated or... Um, yeah, either he's underrated uh, or he's smurfing. I will say that for sure. Because he's playing really, really good chess. He's playing like a good, like, at least like 2,400. That's what I would say. But more power to him. There we go. Yeah, he's probably like 2,400, I'd say. 57. Okay, we're cruising. We're up to four in a row. We just got to keep it going. I think there's a Marcel. Thank you so much. Ah, I got a bad pairing. I think there's a Justin Murray. Thank you to Vera Tastoranis. Oh, let's play F4. Go here. Takes. I just... I can take both ways. I guess I'll take with the Bishop. Trade the queens, play an end game. Do I know when my next classical chess turn is? Uh, it's not really set yet. Set in stone, I should say. Let's play h3. I got. I got to stop knight g4. Ah, he plays f6. There's castle take. Should be okay here still. Take. So go here, guard the pawn. <sighs> Frustrating. I go here. This should be okay. I, I guess once I get knight bd2 and I should be okay. We'll see. A little preem of this. What he does.
Do I like online chess more than an actual chess board? Uh, it's mixed. I don't really have like a specific preference per se. Uh, but I do think because I played so much more online in recent times, I probably am a little bit better. Uh, it goes there. Interesting. I'll take. Oh, I can actually trade. I'm going to 84. This pawn is super soft. He has to go C4. Do I go knight C5 or do I go knight D4 is a big question here. Knight C5 looks right. Looks right. On the other hand, it also looks wrong. But I guess I'll do it. B3, chip away at the structure. I think I can go knight D4 here. Of course, the trade, I've got a jumbo pony on C5. I mean... Well, I allowed rook b5, but wait, but wait, but wait, but wait. I can go rook a4. This bishop is so bad on, a, on c8 that this should somehow be winning here, if I'm precise. Let's go here. Yeah, I think I'm actually winning here, because I just take and I have rook a8, and the bishop is just dead. We're going to get another quick win, I think, here. Yeah, I think we're going to get another quick win. This is very good. Oh, I didn't. Oh, I did not see that. But okay, this still should be winning. Rook a five. I didn't see rook takes d four. But still, trying to go bishop c six, then d four. Okay, so I guess I'll go. I'll go here to start. I'll play here to hit the rook. Then I go king f two, king e three, and this okay resigns. Good. 61, we're, we're five in a row. Thanks so much to Alan Robertson for the prime and Woomox for the prime. 27 minutes to go. I'd like a couple easy pairings. Just give me like a couple 2400s. Of course, I get Benjamin Bach, which is exactly not the pairing I want here. Uh, ugh. Let's play Bishop E2 and Castles. Yeah, I was hoping I'd get like one or two more easy pairings. That was my hope. Go H3 and just castles, of course. Whoa! Thank you so much to Chess for the 50 gifted subs. Thank you so much to Chess for the 50 gifted. Appreciate it. Thank you so much to Chess! Chess has gifted 50 subs to viewers. Thank you so much to Chess for the 50 gifted subs. Appreciate it. Okay, I will play rookie one here. I still have knight c4, of course, at some point. Should have played knight c4 right away, of course. Also play, yeah. Uh, wait, what am I doing? Let's go here. If I take on d4, takes on e1, what am I missing? I just take. Take with a knight. I don't know if I'm actually winning here, but I think I'm okay. Uh, Jose's getting the 3k rated players now. Aha, uh -huh, okay. Makes sense, yeah. I mean, I had a big, big run there where I had to play like really, really good players. I'm still playing very good players even now. Thanks so much to KJB Vucic for the 30 months. Appreciate it. Bishop F8 just looks weird. It just looks weird. Uh, Chess just subscribed. Nakamura spam. Nakamura flower. Nakamura. It looks wrong. Nakamura L. Nakamura power. I'm just gonna take. I have knight d6 here as well. He takes. But now I think I just go like bishop d4. But I think I just go d4, knight e3, rook c1. And I mean, it's hard to believe that I'm not just a little bit better here. Like, I'm not like winning or anything. But I, I really should not be in any danger. And it should be a small clean advantage. Let's just go back. Because knight d3, I go bishop c3. Jose drew a game, it looks like, so he's not on any kind of streak it looks at the moment. But I still have to win this game just to just to get within four points. So it goes there, I go here, of course. I don't like knight d3, by the way. I had bishop a3 too, I guess, but whatever, who cares? Is there an actual tactic that I'm missing or not? Let's go here. Yeah, I'll go rook e1, I guess. And then queen d1. I mean, black has play here, but I feel like I'm okay. Go here, I guess, to hit the bishop. 
That was a dubious move by me. Uh, don't like my position. I was better, but I've misplayed this. I, I was definitely better, but I misplayed it. Go here. Very hard to judge, too. He goes king h7, which looks weird. Like, very weird. I don't think I can lose now. Oh, he takes. Wait. Wow. If I take with a pawn, it's no good. So I take with a knight. Trades. Goes there. I go here. This doesn't look right at all. What is he doing? Well, first of all, h5 hangs. Secondly, there's king g2. Are there any other tricks here, though? I think I should just be solid with king g2. g4. I take and play knight e3. Tricky, though. Maybe I just take and play like knight e2. Just cover everything here. Like knight e4. I have queen e4 too, I guess. Yeah, let's just trade the queens. Gotta be right to trade the queens. And now he's low on time, so I should be able to flag him too. So he's got this though. Check and take, and there we go. Yay! There we go. D7 and that's GG. There we go. Big win. Thanks. Thanks for Lobo Slam. Thank you to Chess. Thank you to Drachki. Thank you so much to Demi and Alex for the Prime. Now give me some 2400s. Let's go. Give me like three 2400s in a row. Or not. <laughs> Uh, no, it's not about the saving 12 seconds. That I won that game before have, with around one minute left on the clock. That was the point. No, I mean, I don't mind playing God in general, but I want some easy pairings here because, like, I need to put big heat on Jose. Is Jose playing a 3,000 or not? Well, the point is that Jose played, like, 24 and 2,500s for, for, like, a long stretch, and I was playing against the absolute top guy, so that's kind of what I'm saying is I hope that I get some of those pairings too. He's playing Bach. Oh, so he's getting tough pairing as well. Wow. D5. Okay, this, this looks like some goddess special. So let's play D6, I guess. I guess I'll play... I can play Rook B8 or Queen B8. I guess I'll go Queen B8. Plays Rook B1, which... Seems reasonable. Uh, I guess I'll go here, maybe 96, 94. Not taking with a bishop, because then he gets tricks. And tricks are for kids. I guess I'll go here. I mean, I want to go 96 and something later, but hard to judge. I suspect I'm in trouble here, objectively. But it, it's a blitz game. Anything can happen, so that's just how it goes. And there's always d5 too. Like it's there are tricks here. I want to play g5. Knight h5 is kind of interesting actually. But so is just like I guess rook c8 is, is also move, but I don't like it. So how do I do this? I guess I'll go here and knight g5 maybe. Although I think that was just a terror. Yeah, it was just a terrible move by me. <sighs> Ridiculously bad. I guess I'll go here to trade. Uh, this isn't what I want to do at all. It goes there, but now at least... Wait, now there's an HG5 and there might be tricks. Wait. I think that was a slight mistake by Gata. Not a big mistake, but a slight mistake. Yeah, because now I have to go back. 
I guess I just drop back to D8 and try to play this game. Okay, Queen D1, logical. I guess I'll drop back. Ah, uh, it's got bishop d1. Okay, so I guess I go here. Just go here, guard everything. I'm in trouble this game for sure. Uh, let's go here. I mean, in trouble maybe is too too strong a word, but I'm I'm definitely under some pressure in this game. I guess I'll just go here to guard everything again. I get knight h5, knight f4, it's, I'm back in business. Let's go back. Yeah, I have knight d4, but I guess I just go all in here with knight h5. Get knight, F, knight d4, I mean, this is very messy. I take the knight, of course. Oh, I can't go bishop g5, which I thought I could. I guess I'll go just here. I just have to hang on. That's what I have to do here. If I hang on, uh, that does give me bishop h3. Does it do anything? Not really. So let's just drop back. Knight h3, knight g5 also playable, but whatever. I'm going to have to just hang on until God gets a long time and just flag him. That's just the reality. Let's go here. Uh, okay, let's just go back. I, I just have to hang on. That's all I have to do here. If I hang on, maybe I can somehow flag him. That's that's what I'm playing for because I'm in a lot of trouble here. I'm gonna go here. Although if I get f5, it starts to get messy too. He's using too much time. Tick tock, got it. Tick tock. Yeah, he's got no time. There we go. All right, we got another dub. Thank you so much to M44TS. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you so much to Finn Guitarist and Gobby Jover. Okay, 2700. Got to win this game quickly, too. I'm flagging everybody. It's not my fault the Goddess technique isn't good enough to win that position. This plays very, very old line. It's been many a year since I played this. Uh, this is, I, I mean, I, I haven't studied this line in ages. This is, uh, I think you can take both ways, but I'll take with the bishop. Maybe six, is that right? Seems slightly wrong. Uh, we'll go back to c2. Let's go. Uh, let's just go here on bishop c2, maybe line up the checkmate. I'll take, I'll go like 95 here. I mean, maybe this isn't actually all that great, but this looks very scary to play against for black. I'm going to go like 95, rook g3, or maybe just, maybe just rook g2, rook g1 even. This looks... Ooh, this looks bad. F3, rook g1. I mean, it's hard to believe that black is okay here. Yeah, I go here. I think I'm going to win this game pretty quickly, too, if I'm, if I'm smart about it. Uh, I guess I'll just move the king out of the way. Step one. Go h4. Okay, obviously I'm going to take, because I don't even know if it's the absolute best way to play, but in the situation, it makes sense. Wait, he should not have resigned. He gets two rooks. Two, he gets the two rooks for the queen. Such is life. Let's go. Now I want to get a 2400 for sure. Oh, I just can't get the 2400. This is frustrating. Okay. Uh, I can't get a 2400. It's very annoying. 
Yeah, I don't know what that resignation was really. So here, trade. I guess I'll play this one. This is a touch safer, perhaps. Knight f6 is also just fine. Go here, develop. I don't actually know if I should go to f6 or e7 here. Both are playable. I'm going to play a6 to stop uh, any weird stuff. Yeah, I mean, if I, if I win another game, I prob if I win this game, I probably will win the event. But plays g4, which is bold and aggressive, and I kind of like it as a concept. I can also check. Actually, let's just be eh, king e2. Let's play h5. This is a little bit aggressive, too. We go to g5. I'll play b5. Go here. Again, though, why did I do this? Because this is not all that... Ugh. It's a little bit icky, too. I don't really like this. I can play f5, maybe? Takes, takes, knight f6. I mean, this is very tricky to play for both sides. I guess... Eh. I guess I'll just go c4 to play knight c5, maybe. I have b4 here. Go after the pawn. Very hard to judge. Yeah, okay, goes knight a4. Which, by the way, why did I play this? Of course, very stupid to... Why did I do that? That, that was just a blunder. Or was it? Maybe I can still go c3. Takes, takes, bishop f2 or something. I guess I'll play... Yeah, I don't like my position at all. Goes for it. I play. But why did I do this? I'll go here and. Yeah, I just messed this up. But I mean, there is play, I guess, with C3 somewhere in here. A4, A3. So here, of course, I can still take. Oh, just. Okay, I just hung a piece. Okay, now I just lose. Maybe, 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 maybe. Wait, whoa, 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 wait a second. Whoa, he just blundered. Why did he do that? Why did Jose just do that? I mean, he just blundered. <laughs> what is going on? What is that? He's just checkmated in Uno. Wow. He got too excited. I mean, it's not over, mind you, but I, I don't know how he's going to hang on now. Yeah, if I, if I win this game and I win one more, he, uh, Jossum cannot catch me. There's a take. I assume I should go A4. I don't want to mess this up, though. It's, like, very critical to not mess this up. So let's go after the pawn. But, I mean, I have two. Is there a threat? I don't see a threat. So let's just go A4. There's no rook e8. I'm just going to push. I just start pushing p. b4, b3. I think this is winning. Yeah, I just start pushing p and he can't stop it. These are Viliox for the prime. So this is where I want to get a 2400 next game. Jose won a very fast game. I might need to win two more actually after this to win the whole event. But we'll see. Uh, let's just go. Uh, let's just go here anyway. Come on, dude. Just resign. Save me time. I mean. Okay, resigns. Let's go again. Come on, give me a soft pairing here. Just give me another soft pairing. <laughs> I still can't get a break. Ridiculous. Absurd. 
Ah, just Yay! absolutely ridiculous. X Pro Legend X. I just, I mean, I like can't get a break. Period. Uh, let's go here. Uh, castle, I play rook d1, go like bishop e3 or something. I mean, it's not perfect, but it's also not the end of the world either. I believe bishop e3 is okay, because I have knight h4 here, and there are problems on the diagonal. Okay, goes rook d8. I guess I'll just take, play like knight d2. A4, logical, play bishop f1, get rid of the b shops. If a3, I have b4 takes rook c1. So that's what I'm banking on. But of course, he sees it because he's using time. Uh, I guess I'll just go like queen e2 here, just consolidate everything. Okay, how do I do this exactly? I don't really want to play a3. I guess I'll just go knight f1, trade the rooks, play simple chess here. Just trade. Oh, a3. I might have to offer a draw soon. I mean, 95, 92, I'm completely fine, but it's not like it's not the dream. Let's put it that way. Go so here, I guess. That looks like a mistake. Yep, that's a mistake. Okay, I think I'm gonna win this game. I'm gonna be on the right side at least. Okay, here we go. Let's go. Free queen. What? 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 Freak. What? I, I don't see it. You. I assume you guys are trolling me, but... Oh. There's a free queen? What? Okay, I'm really confused. Let's just go... Oh, wait. Let's just go here. There's a free queen. Okay, well, I mean, maybe I'm just stupid. I don't know. I didn't see it. Okay, I guess I'll trade the rooks. Ah, uh, wait. That was a little bit careless. Go here. Yeah, because knight g3 takes h2, king g2. I just barely hang on. I very nearly just threw this game away. Very nearly, but... It was rook f6. Okay, so knight g3 is not a threat, right? So how do I rotate everything, I guess? Knight c1, knight d3 makes sense. Yeah, I think knight d3 to go after the pawn. Takes, takes, doesn't work. g5. Actually, that's... Go here, take the pawn. Queen d2, queen g5. Should be good. I should be in time here to win the game. I think he has to go g4. Everything else just loses. Thank you so much to X Hamster X for the 14, X Pro Legend for the Prime. Thank you so much to uh, Nate Fall and Basic Pitch for the Prime. Just great. And now, right on cue, uh, I have a computer coming in too. Ridiculous. Right on cue, my computer's arrived. And it's. One second. Ah, oh, great. Uh, uh, let's go here. Go here. No, no, I, I think I have to sign something, but. Uh, what am I doing? Yeah, one second. Storm 2709 just subscribed.
Nakamura takes Nakamura here Nakamura takes Nakamura GGYO Nakamura thinks Uh Here we go, one second. All right, let's go. Uh, thanks so much to Storm for the 42 months. Uh, okay. Uh, thanks so much to Corey, VI, Sean, and Anaham. Okay, I got to win one more, right? Let's take, go here, take. Okay, Jose Drew, so he cannot catch me, right? Jose Drew, right? I think I'm gonna sack here and go for the kill. I can even take maybe. Let's see. Didn't chess.com say you're not allowed to make these quick draws, by the way, you guys? Or am I crazy? I could have sworn they said you're not allowed to make the quick draws. <laughs> and they quick draws. I could have sworn, I could have sworn that chess.com said you're not allowed to do this anymore. It doesn't matter because I'm going to win the event, but it's, I'm pretty sure they, said, they, were, they actually put out an email saying you're not allowed to do that. Okay, I can't do it. So I'm going to use the restroom. I'll be right back, you guys. Okay, what happened? All right, there we go, you guys. The end of the uh, 
the end of the arena and the winner when all is said and done is of course grandmaster hikaru the best streamer and of course the best chess player on chess.com so congrats to hikaru he does win the event 22 wins uh one loss and two draws the irony of course is the one loss is obviously the very the the very first game So yeah, very, very good stuff. We we get the one with 81. Thank you to Ugalov Plays. Thank you to Semosan. Thank you so much. All right, you guys. So on that note, we are going to be transitioning away from chess. We are going to be playing some poker. So uh, I'm going to be apparently be playing uh playing playing some poker. So we are going to start right away with our poker se segment. I thought it was going to be in an hour, but apparently we're going to be starting right away. So let me log in, pull up some pull up some tournaments. I think uh I will play uh I'll play some tournaments. Let me see what the highest buy in they have that's going on right now. Just give me one second. Uh and we will go from there. Uh all uh Oh, let's just play cash. Let's play some cash. So let's play I will play two four. Let's play let's play some two four. Give me one second. Or wait. Oh wait, no, sorry, the tournament. Sorry, there's a tournament. Uh never mind. I'm playing my planned tournament. One second. Where is it? A private. Uh let me find it. Uh Sorry, it's a free roll. I'm stupid. I didn't realize it was going on. Let me let me let me pull it up. Uh it is uh where is it? There are let me find it. Tournaments? Uh tournaments pri is it private or not? Just give me one second. You guys will like, get it set up. No, it's starting now. There will be five thousand dollar bounty if you knock me out of the tournament. So free roll, maybe it's under free roll. I don't see it. One second. Where is it? Uh oh, there it is. Gem Hikaru free roll. Here we go. It started. Let me pull it up. Uh, it says it's starting in one hour, 58 minutes. One second. Poker is so similar to chess. Indeed it is. Uh, underscore BJRD just took five Let me see. Out of Bezos's pocket. Thanks. One second, one second. Oh, never mind. Apparently, it starts in an hour, you guys. So apparently, we're gonna keep playing chess. Okay, so let's play some chess. I, I, I don't get it. Whatever. Okay, let's keep going. I'm wrong. We have an hour of chess, and then we'll play. We'll play. We'll play poker. So let's play some chess instead while we're waiting. Again, a big shout out to everybody who's watching. Hope you guys are having a fantastic afternoon. Let's let's get going. We're gonna play chess. It starts in an hour, apparently. Okay, so my original idea was right. By the way, my rating is looking very beefy. It's 32-38, so I will lose rating. But let's just play chess and have fun, because why not? What, what else is there to do? Things are just Mac, Mac frickin' Jones for two and Hummingbird. Uh, let's play E6. Categories chess, yes. Oh, did I say best streamer? I thought I said best chess streamer, but who cares? Nobody cares. Not me, not anybody, nobody. But the tournament will be starting in an hour, you guys. Sorry about that. Go here. Things are to Herb Johnson. So he goes A3. Oh, let's see. I can Castrol here. I can also not Castrol. I can also play like F6, but I think Castle should be decent here. I can always go E5, play for D4. So we'll just keep rocking and rolling, you guys. So yeah, we're going to be playing poker in an hour. We'll be doing a, uh, there will be a 5K bounty on my head, which means if you knock me out of the tournament, you will make $5,000. So it's a big, big event. We'll also be doing, I believe, two $500 giveaways as well, which means even if you're not playing, as long as you have an ACR account, you can sign up for the two giveaways and we'll be giving away $500 to two different people. So it's going to be hype. Let's go here in IG6 and go from there. Yep. Things are shot. Monsieur Bacteria was taken for the prime. They did G3R STV for the prime. Uh, appreciate it. Thank you. By the way, huge performance by me and Tata Steel. I had a feeling there was some tax that I was missing and sure enough, there was. Uh, yeah, I had this feeling there probably was something missing. Crud. Although, how bad is this? Can I get a knife to F4? Maybe it's not that bad. It's bad, but it's maybe not super bad. It's maybe only mildly bad. I mean, as Gary Kasparov, the famed world chess champion, said, a knight on F4 is worth at least a queen. So, uh, queen C5 is a move? How do I do this? I have to consolidate the position somehow. He wants to go rookie 7. I guess I'll just go here. Just to guard everything, kind of. Jospin lost two, drew three, and won two. Yeah, I mean, chess is tough. 
Of course, I should not have allowed rookie four. But I can take and go f5 too. Let's take. Let's go f5. <coughs> Just take and drop back. Because there's no ice skater because I have rook f8. So it's all good. Yeah, we're all good, you guys. Check out the chess.com tweet. I don't know what you mean by that. Again, big shout out to 37,000 of y'all who are watching today on this fine Wednesday afternoon. Big shout out to everybody who loves chess. It's a game that's been around for many, many, many of your of your progeny or your predecessors or, or what, whatever the saying is. I don't, I don't know. I, I mean, I'm not very good with that stuff. So a big shout out to everybody who's watching. Hope you're having a fantastic day wherever you are in the big wide world. Many previous generations of your family played the game too. Now I can go G6 here. Uh, G5 is also interesting. Rook G5 is probably the most like stable move to say to basically like just play the game of chess. But I also am talking too much, so let's just let's just go here. Just guard everything. Should be okay. It was D4, which I also really don't like. Uh, not that I hate it, but I feel like I'm starting to get some play here, kind of. Oh, <laughs> I should have gone g6 and rook f8. Wait, but I have queen e1 maybe? Oh, here comes the queen. Here comes the pokey main. Oh, and rook f3, I trade and go rook f8. Actually, wait. Rook f4? Probably just a draw. But let's see what else he can do. I think there's a manual pokey. Thank you so much to manual pokey. Let's take, check. Do I have tricks here like some h5 tickle or some g6 tickle? Tickle, tickle. I don't know if I do. Got queen e4. If I go g6. Queen h6, queen d6. I don't know. I'm going to go for it. Maybe it's wrong. I'm going to try it, though. Because if, it's a, if, if I lose, I lose, but I don't care. It's a free roll. Your first buy in, I believe, is free, and then it's $2.20 after that, I believe. So I go here. Oh, am I just like actually not? It's just not working. Oh, maybe I'm just an actual idiot. I mean, you can go king e2, but ah, uh, I should have had something better than this. <laughs> Excuse me as well. Underscore underscore code just subscribe. Yeah, it's a draw. Okay, go again. Play e4. Thanks so much, Joe Coast, for the tier one out of my end for the prime. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Go bishop c4. Uh, play queen h5 here. Yeah, that was a draw. I mean, I didn't realize that uh, how low on time I actually was there, so it was a mistake, but it is what it is. He didn't have a forced win. I didn't have a forced win. It was just a draw, I think, the whole way, pretty much. Minus four for a draw. Welcome to my world of pain, you guys. That's my world of pain. It is a world that I live in, and it's very unfortunate, but that's how it goes. It's my world of pain. It's very sad. Let's put it that way. Uh, all right, I will just castle, take, and play like d4, d5. All pretty standard. Are the Gotham Knights owned by Levy? I assume they are, but I don't actually know for sure on that. I, I would assume so, but honestly, I don't know for a fact. So here, let's trade. Let's play rookie one. Are you and Magnus in the same Pro Chess League team? I do not believe so. I don't even know if Magnus is playing the Pro Chess League. Uh, I actually have no idea. So it is what it is. Play D3, Bishop E3. Actually, maybe just bishop d2, bishop c3 is also logical here. I'm playing this like my name is like Magnus or something. Let's go here, queen g3. Very, very slow, kind of like grindy-ish position. But it is what it is. 
They tweeted Magnus is going to play. Okay, I, I don't know you guys, but anyway, let's take with the juicer. Queen F8 logical. Should be a little bit of a wrinkle here, though. Something that I can do to spicy it up. He offers a big draw. I will not take a draw. I should be better here with precise play. Okay, he goes there. Go here to hit the knight. Because now I have knife F5, too. Go here. Hit the pawn. Should be better, but how much better? Again, I'm looking to get my knife to f5. Okay, go. If I go queen g3, what, he wants queen d5, I guess. I'm bishop h6. Let's see. Uh, don't like my position here, actually. I have to be, I have to be honest. I guess I'll go here and bishop e3. Still should be okay, though. Yay! I can also take and take. A compromised downpour I just take, took $5 take. out of Bezos's pocket. Thanks. Another month of taking $5 from Bezos and putting it towards a hard work. I think I can take this pawn unless I'm stupid. And also take h5 too. Hard to judge what's going on here. Very, very hard to judge. Okay, so I take, I guess. If I take queen b2, uh, queen d1, rook c6 is just a draw. I'll go back and just drop back. I'd love to take the pawn, but I can't. But both pawns are still hanging. Rookie two. Probably a good move, by the way, but. Yeah, probably this is just a draw. But it is what it is. Probably go h3, king h2. It goes there. I guess I can play queen d2, though. King h2, maybe f3. Trying to go after this pawn if I can somehow. Play c5, which to me at least seems a little bit bold. Wait, I feel like there's probably some tricks here. I'll go here. Again, I'm low on time though. I'm moving too slowly. I guess I'll go for this. I mean, okay, whatever. Let's just go for it. Go here. A uh, queen h7. I mean, this is very hard to defend for a human. So check. Is rook f? Okay, blunder is good. There we go. There we go. There we go. Good win. Thank you so much. A compromise down. I think it's Silver Sigma and get Gadriel Casal. Let's play a Sicilian here. Okay, pretty standard stuff. I'm going to play b6, bishop b7, rook c8 here. I can go knight d7. I'm going to play queen c7, queen b8 with like e6, I guess. Obviously, trade. Uh, Let's go here, trade. We go here. Knight f5, I just go bishop h8. Is a four logical. Uh I have definitely not played this particularly well. 
Guess I'll go e6 anyway. I'm like, my rook should be on f8 here, not e8. I'll go like... I'm actually just playing this horribly. This is just terrible. What am I doing? It was king h1 i expected that i will just play i don't know like i guess i'll go queen e7 and knight e7 here so e5 i just trade and go knight e7 i should be okay goes bishop c2 e5 is a very committal move but i actually think it makes some sense to play it because knight e5 i trade and go knight e4 i'm trying to put a put plot my own pony on d4 here i get my own pony to d4 to plop uh, I guess I will go here to trade the p more ponies. I can play f6 somewhere. It should be okay. So let's see. It goes 92. I can trade. I don't have to trade. I guess I'll go back. Problem is he might just try to make a draw with knight c3. Okay, he doesn't. So let's go f6. I guess I'll go g5 here. Is h4, I'm going to take and swing king h8, rook g8. Goes there, I'll go here, of course. I go here. I actually, I'm starting to like my position quite a bit. Like, I've got a5, knight c5. Okay, so he does play h4. This is a very, very committal move. I think he's full of Blagna, though. I'm going to call his bluff and play, like, rook g8, rook g4, and knight c5, and knight d4. I think he's full of Blagna here. Just a guess. Thank you to Nathan McCrary for the 16 months. Thank you so much to Browbeater for the Prime. I appreciate it. Thanks so much to Browbeater. Thank you. So I really like what's going on here. I've got like these grips on the dark squares. Okay, do I go rook g4? I assume I do. I have rook g8. Queen h6. Uh, does it do anything? I can play knight c5 here, but I think I just go queen f8. Or rook g8. Actually, maybe just here first. And now I go queen f8. I think I'm quite a bit better here. Or maybe not, actually. He's got bishop d1. I can sack, of course. Huh. Maybe I'm not much better. I'll go here. Knight c5. These knights are very, very powerful as well. His knight on h5 is kind of boxed here, but it's still not clear cut. Hard to judge what's going on here. Very, very hard to judge that. Hangs something, I assume. That hangs a pawn at the very least. And these knights are very, very good. I'm going to reroute the pony back to c5 again. Goes knight b5. That's actually a good move. I didn't see that. Uh, not easy somehow to prove this. If I take and play d5, no good. I don't want to trade. Very hard to prove this, actually. Very, very weird. Let's go here. He plays rook d3. I don't have rook d8. I mean, I, I get his idea. Oh, 97 is just a horrible move. I was, I was just much better, and I just flubbed this. Yeah, this was so bad, I guess. I guess I'll go here, maybe. I mean, time is even, I guess, so there is that. Go here, I guess. Ned Sumi Chess just subscribed. I want to trade. Uh, okay, I guess I'll go. I got to come with a move here, actually. E5, C5. No, no, no. 92. King. Da, 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 da. So I can always take the bishop.
Oh, there's check. Oh my God, there's checkmate in one. That was so stupid. Oh, that was so stupid. Ah, oh, I just hung the mate in one. Oh, that was ridiculous. Yeah, that, that was ridiculous. I was so much better there early. That that's that's that is a bit of a tragedy because I was much better. Ah, oh, that's frustrating. Okay, let's let's think for a second. So wait, so here, I want to come up with a move. I'm gonna play ninety four again because it looks correct. Feels like I should be better here, but I have to prove it somehow. I'm just gonna go h four. And play like here. If it was like a5. I'll go like here and bishop f4. Don't know if this is actually great, but it's an idea at least. Oh, he's just gonna play the same idea actually, which I of course completely forgot existed. <clears throat> I take, 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 bishop a3. It's not very attractive. I guess I'll just go here, keep it simple. So stupid. This looks like the exact same game is very similar. Yeah, what what happened to poker? Uh, that's gonna be a little bit later on. I'm not sure if that's at three or four. Thank you, Ned Zumi Chess for the five and Louis Placencia for the five. Appreciate it. Thanks so much. Yeah, I just uh, that last game I was I was better for a move or two, but I got careless. I'm not sure I'm not quite sure where the win was though, to be honest. I'll play C4. It goes Queen E5. I can obviously trade. I also can just go like King H2, I guess. Again, I don't know why I blitzed out these moves, because my position is not really all that wonderful. Maybe I just go like here. H5, okay, so. Oh, right, he's trying to go queen g6, of course. Again, I'm, I'm so far down on clock here that this is bad. Yeah, I'm so far down on clock that if I try to win, I'm probably going to lose. He can make the draw if he wants. I don't, I don't really care. Minus 30 per loss. No, I was 32-38 when I started, so not great, but it's it's okay. If he, if he takes like a minute and plays queen e5 here, like he goes down like one minute or 30 seconds, I'll probably just not play him again. I did win the event, yeah. Yeah, okay, that's enough. No more. Sorry. Uh, let's let's find somebody else to play. I'm I'm just not I'm not in the mood for that. Let's let's challenge Jose. Yeah, I mean he could have done it in like 10, 15 seconds, but to like run his clock down there for like 40 seconds before doing it. Yeah, I'm just not in the mood for it. Let's challenge somebody else. Uh, yeah, Joe Bob is Joe Bob online? I didn't see him. I'll play Joe Bob, of course. Uh, Jobob has wanted to play me a lot lately, but he's he's playing right now. So I'll, I'll wait till Jobob is done, and then I'll play him. Uh, or I'll send out some other challenges, too. Let's challenge some other people. Do I think chess will ever get uh, updated? Chess will ever get what? Sorry, do I think chess will... No, I mean, it's just it's just the style of the way that he did that. That's all. Like, he, 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 like I've played him a million times. It's not, it's not about that. It's like, I played him a million times. He could have made the draw, like, 10, 15 seconds. But then he purposely ran the clock down to waste time. So, uh, just, I, I just don't want to deal with that. Uh, who else is online? Let's see. Andreka. Let's see, let's challenge Don Dimmy, whoever this is. I don't know who this is. Challenge Don Dimmy. Uh, too strong for me? No, it's nothing, it has nothing to do with that. <laughs> Trust me, if I, if I was worried, if I thought he was too strong, I was worried. I would never have played him in the first place. I knew I was going to lose rating points, but thank you. Okay, let's play Jose. Play a good old fashioned brawl with Jose. Let's play E3. Play D4. Guess I'll just play 
Let's play Bishop D3. I'm going to play this like a Daniel Naroditsky. Daniel in the U.S. Championship when he played in 2021, maybe it was, was always playing this, like, this setup. So let's play like a Daniel Naroditsky. Uh, I will just take and go E4, I guess. It was D5. Interesting. Very interesting position here, by the way. Really quite interesting. I don't even know what's going on. It's, but it's very... It's very unusual, actually. Very unusual. Go here to trade. Because Rook C8, of course, I trade. Takes with a knight or the, or the queen. I don't know which one he'll take with. Takes with a knight. Logical. All very standard. I'll go queen g4 to hit the knight. Probably go rook d1, queen g3. Again, pretty balanced position, though. Actually, like, very balanced. You know what's funny is in, in the... Uh, in Arena Kings, I did not play Jose once, did I? I didn't play Jose one single time. Even, even though we were, like, the leading for, like, the whole event, felt like we didn't play at all, did we? Or did we play once? I don't think we played, but maybe chat can correct me. Okay, let's see. Uh, D4. Knight is not where I want it. Pawns are not ideal. I guess I'll go back. Should be the correct square. Maybe we played very early. I'm not sure. It's, it's possible we played a game early. I'm going to try to reroute the knight to, uh, to uh, A3. No, I don't think I did, actually. I don't think I played him. I played Jobaba like a gazillion times, like a gazillion times. Yeah, I didn't play him. That's, that's, that's wild, actually. We were le leading for like the whole time. They had a Rambo. Yeah, that's just crazy. Crazy. Have I played against Georgian players? I've played many players. I've played Levon Pantsulaya. I actually, you know what's funny is I don't know if I've ever played Jobaba. If I ever played Jobaba over the board in like a serious game, I don't think I have. I don't think I actually have, which is also kind of crazy too when you think about it. <sighs> Georgian players are very good players. Yeah, I agree. Totally. Uh, how do I want to do this? I guess I'll just go F3 to cut off squares here and just take with a knight. And pretty balanced position. Uh, I can obviously trade. I should trade, actually. Go here. <clears throat> Go here, like bishop f1, bishop c2. Balanced. Not very exciting, but it's balanced. Goes f5. I guess this is the idea to play f4. Maybe it is. I can always go g3. Or no, I can't go g3. What am I doing? I guess I'll just play here. <clears throat> I guess I'll go here. So they have a4, I have b4. Although now I also have f4, I thought. Bishop f3, maybe. Of course, this was fairly stupid, too. Uh, I think I have to just force a draw here. If I can, actually, which is not a guarantee, but probably I can. Let's go here, trade, 94, king, king f1. Should just be a draw. Go here. King f1 also kind of a little bit dubious, too. Uh, wait, there. Go here. Maybe I just play a4, but a4 is such an ugly move to play. I guess I'll play it. It's not the move I want to play, but block it all up. <clears throat> yeah, just a drop. Horrible game. Not playing well ever since uh, Arena Kings out a little bit flat. Uh, let's play a French. I, I don't. I don't feel like I play Frenches very frequently against uh, Jose. Plays exchange. Okay, let's play Bishop B six. Do I know any German Twitch streamers? No, I don't really. I mean, there's Papa Plata, the, uh, who, who played chess. So, I mean, I'm familiar with him, but that doesn't mean that I know him or anything. Like, but yeah, I, I, don't, I don't really, I don't know. 
I mean, there haven't been like really big collaborations ever since like PogChamps. I would say Pog PogChamps three was that the was uh, or sorry two. I think two was the one that Nico won, right? PogChamps two, I would say there was uh there there were some good collabs for sure. Pop a platta, bro. Ah ha ha ha. Oh, is there is there something wrong with him or something or? Or, or I don't know, what, whatever. I, I don't know if you guys are trolling me or what you're saying, but yeah. Yeah, this is just like as boring as a position as you can get. But Jose is really just not very excited to play chess. Looking forward to you reading souls at three. What is a collab with PewDiePie? I don't know. Thank you, Vortex Rusty, for the 12. Is there an epistel thing to Reicher for the tier one? I mean, again, this is super dry. He can put his knife on f5, obviously, but doesn't change anything. I'll trade. He can take with the pawn, I guess, but. Or no, he can't, sorry. The knight hangs. Uh, I don't want to do this. I guess I'll just drop back, consolidate a little bit. This is really not very exciting either, I have to, I have to be honest. 37k viewer peak, by the way, is insane. Uh, we've had higher peaks in recent times. Chess has been popping off, so what What can I say? We're not five. Huh. Greetings from Canada. Reasonable move. Doesn't really do much, but... It's like, how do I dodge a draw? I don't know how to dodge a draw. I'll go here and trade. I'm just playing knight f8. Should be okay. Because knight f5, I also have f6. I'm just king f7, knight e6, and these knights are not jumping for once, so I should be in good shape. I think it's almost a rainbow trout for the two months. I need a mist, mist fern. Rainbow trout says greetings from Canada. Big shout out to everybody who is watching from the great country of Canada, also known as the uh, 50, 51st state of the United States of America. You look great, bro. I feel good. I mean, obviously, my voice is still bugging me just a touch, but. That's just life. What to do? What what can you do about it? So I will go h5 here. King f7, knight e6, and I should be in good shape. Let's go here. Again, very very hard to do anything. I guess I'll try something here, like maybe here. Oh wait, there. Oh wait, no, knight e6 is not a move. Yeah, yikes. So go here to hit the knight. Ah, he blundered. Yes, I tricked him. I tricked. I tricked him. I think. Yeah, because I have knight takes d4 here, and then it's a check. Yeah, I tricked him. Okay, he goes there. Of course, I take. Of course, I take. And now the question is, do I play knight e1? I assume I take and take. I just bring the king forward. I mean, I'm only up a pawn here, but my assumption is that I have the wide peepo split. So because I have the peepos, I, because I have peepos, I assume this is winning, but not 100% sure. Yeah, like I think I split the pawns so that we have the peepos. Like it feels like this should be winning somehow. He resigns. Wow. Okay. Peepos. Two peepos. Too much. Let's play it English. Uh, let's play e3. Play d4 here. I'm gonna play knight f3 and then d4. I guess. But I can also trade and play like d. I'll play this this old line. This is a very very old line. D4, e6, bishop d3, takes castles. All very very standard stuff. Obviously, trade takes is a line. It's not great. A3 is a line. Many options to be or not to be. What is the move? Uh, let's just play. Let's just play on the safer side. Is juicer any piece? Juicer, you guys. The juice is whatever you want it to be. Of course, I should tickle, tickle. Let's tickle, tickle. 
Probably just gonna go like beast. Well, b6 allows. Yeah, so now the king's on a worse square in this end game. I'm gonna go bishop b2, open up the double op combos here, and I feel like I'm doing pretty well. Hard to judge actually as I look at the position though. A little bit. I should have played bishop b2 first. Let's go here. Double ops. I feel like I'm doing pretty well, just judging by the position and time usage. <clears throat> How do I attack, though, is the question. I'll go here. I guess I'm going to go g4, g5. This is a very aggressive approach. I don't even know if it's good, frankly, but it stops f5. Oh, he has queen a5, which is a very good move that I just did not see at all. <clears throat> yeah, I did not see this move. This is a very, very good move by Jose. Uh, how do I do? I mean, I can play g5 or h4. Let's just play a3 to stop knight b4, I guess. And then I'm going to go h4, g5 or something. Let's play rook c1 here. go h4 i'm not even afraid i'm just gonna play h4 at g5 i'm asking jose what his idea is exactly here trades i i obviously take with the queen who's there okay go back of course i want to go king g2 i don't want to play knight d4 either queen c3 he has bishop f6 Go King G2. Again, very hard to judge what's going on here, but I should be okay. Best chess streamer. Thank you so much, you guys. Appreciate it. It goes knight a5 here, which is, of course, a move. It's not the move, but it is a move, which is probably playable. I can obviously go for the tickle-tickle again, but it doesn't really look right. Bishop d4 does actually look kind of aggressively right. So let's do it. So if he takes, I assume I have rook a1 and some trickery. Okay, Frigid, let's just go for g5. Let's just attack, attack, attack. That's, that's what they say. That's the saying. It was h5. I can obviously tickle, tickle. Of course, I don't know why I didn't see h5 because this is just a ridiculously obvious move. Let's go here, target the knight, target the pawn. Good move. I feel like I have chances, though. I feel like I'm kind of okay. I guess I'll go here. Not that that does anything because he just goes knight c6 and I'm just an idiot. Let's try c5. This probably is bad, but let's try it. Because I figure eventually if the file opens, he'll get attacked. More, more, more so than I will. But he takes. <laughs> Queen c8, also a good move. Or actually not really. I go here in e4. I can play rook d1, but he can sack. And take. Go back. Doesn't look right. Rook d1 looks like the correct move, so I'll play it. It goes queen e8. Oh, I'm down on clock. What the heck? Yeah, I should just make the draw here. Okay. Yeah. All right. English to K Chung for the prime. Ansi, by the way, for the prime. Thank you so much. Uh, let's play. Uh, let's play the Owens defense. Thank you to Rakofi. Thank you to Hank HDX, David fourteen eight ninety nine. Thank you to Mister Muadi and Cybergox. Thank you so much for the primes, you guys. Appreciate it. You think he's dry because he wants to farm Elo? I mean, he's playing good chess. Like he's doing what he can. Like he didn't try to actively just draw there. Like we just played a game and it was a draw. I mean, I'll always. Anytime that happens, it's all good. When people actively just try to like draw every game, that's when it's like, eh, Subscribe. a little bit different. Trade, let's go here.
So let's just go here in knight c6. Uh, I don't know if poker's on, you guys, because apparently it's supposed to be a free roll, but currently it's $2.20 buy-in. If it's $2.20 buy-in, I'm not running the tournament because, like, I'm not going to run a poker tournament where people have to buy, buy in. If it's a free roll like it's supposed to be, then we'll probably run the poker tournament. If not, we'll reschedule it for another day. Because, I, I mean, I'm just... That's not right for, for our audience. Like, that's, that's not the point of it. Yeah. It's currently saying it's 220 on ACR, you guys. So... It is saying that. Like, I, I'm not making it up. Go here. I'm trying to reroute the ponies here. I guess I'll go here. Go here, just develop. Probably I'm castling queenside at some point, but go here, king a8, of course. I'll just go back, of course. Uh, at some point, I probably have F6, depending how I play this. But let's just go here for now. There's also, like, D4 tricks, too. I'll just drop over. Okay, I think I'm going to go F6 and try to chop away at the structure a little bit here. Hard to judge whether these pawns are strong or weak. Very, very hard to judge. Thanks for shot Muggy Maggie for the Prime. Thanks so much to Muggy Maggie. Appreciate it. I did win Arena Kings. Yes, I won it for 150 Subarus. Su su did I just say Subarus? Huh, for 150 subs. <laughs> 150 Subarus. Yeah, let's go. Uh, let's just go uh, here, I guess. 150 Subarus would be something. That, that, would be a, that would be a lot, right? Go back. He takes. Now, of course, I can take with the pawn or the bishop. I'll take with the bishop here. Because e5 is still a big threat. Rook e8 is still a move. I guess I go here. And yeah, knight b4 is logical. I'll drop back to go knight f7, knight d7. Go here, trade. Could have played a5 too, I guess. Oh, I missed knight g6. Oh, yeah, yeah. I have knight f8, maybe. Yeah, let's just go here, trade the knights. That's a big tax bill for that many Subarus. Yeah, I know. Tell me about it. Okay. Yeah, he's happy to make a draw. Uh, and I don't know. I guess I'll take. I'll play this. It's not what I would normally do, but you know, life is short. You might as well live. Okay, let's go a5. Go here to hit the bishop. Yeah, he's got f3, which of course I conveniently forgot existed. I guess I'll go here to go knight g5. Go here. Let's go here. I, mean, I feel like I've got some play going on here. Uh, <clears throat> how do I do it, though? Yeah, I think I just sack. I, I think I sack and go d4, d3. I play for the obvious counterplay. He takes? Wait, what? A d4? This is actually very scary for white, suddenly. Queen c3 is a great move, though. I missed that. Queen c6, maybe? I also have knight e4. Still very, very hard to play. Because I have knight g5, I mean... Go here. I'm going to go C3. Of course, I messed this up too. <clears throat> uh, 
Ah, I've won. Oh, if I go king eight, I win the game. Ah. If I go king eight, I win the game. Oh, that's so stupid. King eight, and I just block with knight a6. Oh, that's so ridiculous. I just block with knight a6. I just forgot his queen takes b2. If I go king eight, I just win like, ah. That was ridiculous. All right, let's play one more. Ugh. Before I just throw away all the rating points that I just gained. This, by the way, is a good example of why uh, it's impossible to keep the rating super high. Because whenever your rating gets near 3250, you end up playing these guys where it's like, this is about as good as I'm ever going to get, like plus four, minus 12. And I mean, Jose, yes, if I'm playing my best, I can beat him three to one, four to one. But on average, I would say that it's probably going to be closer to like two and a half, two to one or two and a half to one that I beat him. So in general, it's impossible to, not in general, it's just, just hard. It's impossible to keep the rating around like 30, above 3250. And if you get much higher than that, then it starts to become even even worse because then you uh, then um that then it's like it's not even it's not even three to one. You went by like four to one or five to one margins, and that's just like never happening, never happening ever. Uh, okay, he goes there. What am I doing here? Wait, let's think. Let's play H four. Talking too much, also. When you got 33, 30, 33, 32 as pure luck, no, that was not pure luck. At the time, there were a lot of people who were higher rated. There was a, there was a lot of inflation in the chess economy at the time, but uh, it has kind of settled itself back out, even without any external help from the chess, chess Federal Reserve. So uh, there was just a lot of inflation at the time. H5, okay. Uh, this should be bad. It should be bad and are bad are two different things. But at any rate, yeah, there there was like you had Yan at 3,200. You had Ali Reza at 3,200. You had like all these guys at these like 3,200 plus ratings who were just like killing it. And now, of course, like almost nobody is 3,200, in fact. Can I go 92? I think I can because D5 I just take. With the knight and I just take take and I'm good. Kind of. Okay, he goes rook d8, which is a mistake. Because now I get... Maybe a mistake is too strong. But I feel like bad things are happening on the, on the king side here. It feels like, at least. Maybe knight d... Oh, no, knight d5, he just takes and goes e4. What am I smoking? Uh, I can play queen f3. I can also go rook f1. I'm going to go queen f3. It should be very bad. What will you stream if you ever quit chess? I mean, I could retire from professional chess and still stream chess, but uh, probably I if I was doing variety, like in like 10 years from now, I'd do like, uh, I would pro wait, what? Isn't this just GG? It oh, he's got Rook F8, of course. I didn't even see Rook F8, typical. <laughs> but this still should be lost. I assume if I sack, I just checkmate him. No? I mean, am I... Is this really not winning for me? Maybe I'm just a terrible chess player, but I, bl I believe I can play as like a Michael Towel. Oh, I just have rook g3? Wait, wait, wait. Takes his king g8, which of course I completely did not see. I check. Again, this... Is this really not winning here? Go check. Go here. Only move queen e6 and... and... He has this because he still has the ice here. But I have knight d5. I mean... Uh, of course I missed bishop g6 too. <laughs> Ridiculous by me. What am I even doing this game? Yeah, I just flubbed this ridiculously at that. And I thought I could even take, and that doesn't work either. Just absolutely horrible play by me. Yeah, what am I even doing? <sighs> 
It's like food. Guess I'll sack and check. Ridiculous. Wait, what? There we go. Horrible. Horrible. Absolutely horrible. So, okay. Play D5. Go uh, G6. Uh, let's just take the pawn here. I will play e5, knight c6 here, maybe bishop e6. Keep it simple. Horrible, a win is a win. Horrible is horrible. Horrible is as horrible does, right? As they say. I guess I will just castrol here and play like bishop d5. I can also play a5 and f6. It's all pretty standard, just bishop. Just can play h6 here. I can also go b5. Uh, a4 is actually, I think, a reasonable choice, so I will play it. I said castrol. Yes, when you move the king of the rook, it's called castroling. If you didn't know that, uh, you need to reconsult your chess books. Okay, let's see. I can play b5 here. I can play knight f5. I can also play rook a6. Uh, let's just play traditional queen d7. Uh, actually, wait. Is the... Uh, one second. Let me, let me pull it up. Sorry, one second. Let me finish this game first, because apparently the, the, the poker stream is back on. So give me a second, you guys. Go here. Uh, let's see. I'll, I guess I'll play. I just got to move. I'm uh, too slow here. Play here. I go 94 uh, takes takes this looks fine does it say it's free i i, I didn't see it I'll, I'll check again uh uh one second sorry trying to play the game takes it's free for the first entry okay so we're gonna be doing poker in seven minutes you guys it's in the private lobby okay Let me find it. Uh, B3 played logical move, not the move I would have played personally, but I guess I'll just go B6 here to play C5. Let's just take with the rook, guard everything. Queen C2, a C5. Now it's like really, really pleasant for me. This should be good, although it's not 100% clear. He goes to C4. I guess I'll go here to play b5. You can play a4, but then knight c6, knight b4 looks quite ugly too. It still says 2.2 buy-in. Okay, give me a second, y'all. Uh, trying to play a chess game too while I do this. Let's go queen a7. b1 logical. Oh, wait. What am I doing? Ah, uh, with the password, it's free. Okay, so let's take. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just like aimlessly moving here. Let's go here. Yeah, I'm trying to like do two things. Halt. Try to do like a bunch of things at the same time, you guys. So 
Uh, let's go here, I guess. Target the pawn. Okay, one lodge. I'll play h5, of course. So here, I'm going to reroute my knight to e4. That's my idea, at least. There's also rook a5, I just realized, too. Once my knight gets to c3, I think white's in a lot of trouble here, actually. Whoa, what? C3? Oof, that's GG. That's just GG. All right, that's the end of the game. All right, you guys, I'm going to go use the restroom very, very quickly, and then we are going to start with our poker portion of the stream, so I will be back very, very shortly. Give me one second, you guys. It's in tournaments free rolls. It's in the private. All right, you guys, we are back, of course, and we are going to continue with our stream. Uh, so, yeah, let me, let me pull it up uh, one second. Tournaments. Free roll, there we go. Okay, it should, be, it should be here. Let me see if I can pull it up. One second, let me see it. One second, you guys, we are going to move on to our... our let me see. Where is it? It is uh, January 18th. One second. So once again, we're going to be doing two giveaways, you guys. So if you do have ACR accounts with America's Card Room, we are going to do two giveaways of five hundred dollars. Uh, to make sure that you are um, that you that you are uh, you you do put your your username in because we're going to give away five hundred dollars. Uh, I'm trying to find the tournament. I still I still can't find it actually. Where is it? Okay, there it is. Okay, there we there we go. Uh, let me register. Okay, there we go. I'm registered. Oh, I need the password. One second. Uh, there's a password, you guys. To, it's the uh, five. It's uh, there. There's a password to 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 register. So let me pull up the password. One second. I think everybody. I think I can. Everybody should let me hit continue. There we go. Okay. I registered. Let me change the scene. Give me one second. But uh yeah, the, the password is AP. I guess I mean mods will put it put it in chat. Uh but we'll we will be giving away uh there will be a five thousand dollar bounty, as I understand. So whenever I get knocked out of the tournament, uh by whomever knocks me out, they will get five thousand dollars from America's card for poker. We're gonna do two giveaways as well for five hundred dollars as well. Even if you're not playing the tournament, even if you just have an account. You can get five hundred dollars for free. Uh, the password was put in chat. It's a capital A lowercase P T T capital uh, U capital K lowercase J capital capital U capital V. So there you go. Thank you for all your hard work. Also, everybody's wondering. It's gonna say it's two dollars and twenty buy-in, but once you go to the actual tournament and register and you put the password in, it will charge you zero point zero zero dollars. I don't know why it was set up to look like that, but there is uh, the buy-in is zero dollars at least. 